little bit of everything this week. First, we went picking at the market. Then we did a little peg picking at Walmart. Then out to the turkey rod run and watch till the end. We got to do some picking at Hot Wheels Dave's booth. All right, out to the market. Back out picking. About 73 degrees out, a little overcast. Just glad people are out. It's the day before Turkey Day. Well, looks like we got some people out here. We don't have such a good day out here today. We're going out to the Turkey Rod Run this weekend. So it's going to be a multi day of picking. Oh, we just walked the entire first aisle. Nothing. Not looking good, guys. Yeah, we got that ugly sauce. Try the second aisle. Sneakers. Here. How many is there? 23, I think. 3, 5, 6, 7, 10, 11, 12, 13, 15, 17, 18, 19, 21. Anyone there? Wouldn't do 15 for all of it? Otherwise, I'll start cherry picking the ones I really want. Yeah, well, they're only a buck a piece. I mean, yeah, I know. I get them for six for five in a lot of places out here. Yeah? Yeah. Six for five. I could do... Uh, yeah, do 15. 15, you're right? Okay. Yeah. Well, I was striking out like crazy, but we got 21 cars for 15 bucks, which isn't bad. But one stop shop. Let's see what else we got. Well, 57 Chevy with some ultra hots on it. That's all right, though, man. No, I, I, no I, big I, deal. I'll, I'll look for it. Yeah, if you find it, you find it. If you don't, you don't. It's okay. So is it just Chevys y'all looking for? Or? No, no. We look for a little bit of everything. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> all right, man. Thank you. Appreciate you. Not a problem. That'll be a good one. Yeah, yeah. Stuff that I've got. How much on your little Hot Wheels? Fuck a piece. Fuck a piece? Yes, sir. That one's worth a buck. for a buck each on the card. Yeah, yeah. Yep. Okay. There's two for that. Can we give you a bag for that? Trying to figure out a way to find hot water here. 
come up on the last table here and look what I found. Seventy-five. Okay, I'll let my son know. Thank you. I had these when they first came out. Pretty awesome. Those are crazy, though. How much are your little cars in here? Where? Down here in the bin. How much are your cars down here? I'm waiting. How you doing, man? Your little cars down here in the bin. How much are they? Due to my thing around you. Let me see what you got. Wow, with the ladder. Yeah, it's just taking all the time. It should be coming to you now. Thank you, son. Appreciate it. Have a good Thanksgiving, all right? Sure, thanks, buddy. I had to make a quick stop at Walmart on the way back. We're here at the aftermath of Black Friday looking at what we just found. Some of these guys wanted a five bucks at the market for some of these new cars. Porsche. Yes. That's awesome. Yes. Love it. Yeah. That's cool with a good year. Oh, Ben's wagon, or I mean Beamer wagon. Manny, you want an RX-8 for yourself? A Holden. Seven months as usual. Get that other RX-8. That's neat. Stuff on shorty cards here too. Here's a little Ford. What is that? Oh, that's a Land Rover. And this is so what else we got, Manny? Pigs are still pretty full. No, there's some stuff. Oh, but the car is messed up. And both yeah, but I want to get that anyway. That, there's this I seen. I haven't been. I did see a the Leno. Days. I saw the Leno the other day. This. Whoa, buddy. What? Haven't seen it. Gotta grab it. Haven't seen it. This is fire too, Manny. Did you see what this is? Yeah. We have some though, right? This is a new one too. I asked him Look at this. Back. Seen this one? Ah, that's all right. But look I at this, Manny. The G body. Oh. Mustang GT and then look. I have not seen this yet. A demon. That's pretty cool. That's wild. Do you want to ask him too or no? I might as well. All right, well, I'm tapping out, man. That's it for me. We're, yeah, we're gonna definitely get there. I'm not gonna go through every peg like Manny does, but here's what I picked up. Look at that, just like that, a card appears. I'm gonna get the Nissan. 
shoes as well. And just like that, look where we are. 2023 turkey gun. Got the wrong car here this time. Man. Oh, we're parked right next to a Hellcat. Remember, under every one of these is one of these. We got Manny with us. And Yami. I'm gonna We're out here looking for some Hot Wheels. Guys, we're parked way out there. We'll get another overview once we get in here, but just the initial parking lot is hot. Great to see a turnout like this this year. Man, Kelly Bean goes. This car just does it for me. Wow. Unbelievable. My name's Jimmy. Hey, Jimmy. Hey, Great to meet you. Look you. what Jimmy got out here, guys. Wow. The Shark and Hutch Tall Guy Truck. Dang. Yeah, that's awesome. Collection. That nice is pickup. awesome. That's a cool couple pickups. of great pickups right there. Thank you. Thank you. Well, great meeting you, man. Enjoy the show. Yeah, man. How much you got on your cards? Three dollars and all. Santa Claus to bring them to me every year, and then after that, I take them and keep them for a year, and then I sell them. And every year, Santa Claus brings me a whole pile of hot wheels. Did you videotape all what I get to see? <laughs> Yeah, I did. I got you on tape, man. <laughs> See anything you need, Manny? Got one three dollars a piece over there. That's a little too much for my taste. Here goes blue Might be doing a lot of window shopping out here with these prices. That's okay. That was cool. Pretty random. This one has a dollar on it. Pretty neat for a buck. Let's see how much this one is. That's cool too. Let's see how much these are. Ma'am, is this your table right here? Yeah. How much? Two bucks. Two bucks? And I found a, wow, farm bag. Yeah. Let's just see how many we can get out of here. The Baja.
Yeah, he owns a 71 van, Ford, kind of line. He owns a, a museum with vans and stuff in it. Pretty neat. He gave me the car, so we'll have to go check him out one day. Oh, look at that old Maisto right there. Yeah, that's cool. Turbo yeah, the, the uh, Tarmac's not a dollar, sorry. Uh, okay. Corner box, yeah. Hey, did you want any of those? You can do any of that other stuff. Like this thing? That's pretty cool, though. All right. Some of these booths are set up really nice. These racing champions. Wow, you don't see these very often. These things. Pretty cool. Spotted my kind of deal right here. How many bucks of cars in it? Let's see what cars are in it. Yep. Got five dollars worth of cars in it. I'll keep that for somebody else. Big man out here. Let's see what he's bringing out to the show. Oh, I've been holding out all the good stuff, man. Okay, I'll go over there now. See, it's just aisle after aisle of stuff. Not the best place to pick for Hot Wheels, though, because a little more expensive. But you might find something rare out here. Keep looking. Bottom a mile away. Two bucks each. Two packs. Not bad for some two packs. It's worth it. Let's see if they got a good, really good one. They're all the same, right? They're all the same. Is that different? Nope. Hold on now. It is, because this is backwards. Oh, uh, yeah. And this is a wheel variant. Probably been open. Yeah, this is stable. Yeah. I got this so many of purple passions. Or pearl passions. because he can spot these things with his eyes. Look at that hot wheel shirt. Wow, look at that beautiful embroidery. Nice thick work shirt. Wow, this is awesome. How much a shirt like that is? It's hell racing on it. Look at 
like a NASCAR crew shirt or something. Yeah, like and then look at this thing. He's, you know, he's not swinging wrenches. He's just organizing the entire machine. What do you find, man? These are uh, his customers. Oh, really? How much do you get for these? They're all numbered 30. Uh, really neat. Did you see that one? Yeah. yeah we'll, we'll, we'll slide this one back over. Cool. That's nice. If you want, you can make me a deal on these. I have extra, you know, back at my car lot. Okay. I have extra of that. They just need to go to a new home. And you see I had the stickers, yep. 12 and 12. That's all I made. Yeah. They're expensive, though, to make. Yeah, They're like 33 bucks a piece to make those things. Really? Yeah, I think that's time to get the wheels. The Chevelle I like, just got done about a month ago. It's I'm going to go look at this. much you get on just the mainline stuff most of them are two there's very few that are three or four dollars like the gas or of course that's not two bucks okay. but for the most part they're two Great stuff. Priced accordingly. Shape though. Mm. See, when you it keep the cars 15. like this, they get all scuffed up. Yeah. Look at this when Johnny was making this stuff. Yeah, it's already out here. Man. Yeah. 20. This is cool. A little bigger still. Get these things, man, you found. Nobody has a my product. This tag is really cool. This is cool. Well, guys, this is not hot rod weather. But we're back to see if there's any Hot Wheels left. Got a slight difference in attendance today. <laughs> wow. I 
didn't realize that this guy has Hot Wheels in his trailer. Look at this setup. Man. Oh, you can't go in. That's like a dream. Appreciative of this awning. What's up, man? How are you? I'm a truck I can help you find. We're just kind of looking. Are they all uh, different prices? Yeah, they're all priced too. It depends on what kind of car you're looking for. This thing's neat. Is this yours? Yeah. Really cool. Yeah, I treat it to where it's like, what kind of car? It's like an ice cream truck. Oh. So you have Nissans, you have Hondas, Mazdas, you have GTRs up there. This is Josh. How you doing? Fast Josh, Josh has one of the coolest trailers I've ever seen. And coolest Supras. Yeah, and the coolest Supra. So pretty awesome man put you on let's go pick it and let everybody see you. and where are you going to be at next you know the next one is cars and coffee west palm beach cars and coffee south. west palm beach yep. so if you're from south florida come west check palm. out josh got some great cars fair prices see anything you don't have many yeah what kind of cars you like mostly hondas some I don't, so you just kind of tell me what you're looking for. Um, some cool ones, like this is a Kroger exclusive. Yeah. That was Best Buy last year. Um, I have CRXs, Preludes, GSRs, S2000. And then I think, did you say this is a Kroger? That's a Kroger yeah. exclusive. I'm gonna get one. I'd say let's uh, let's get one of those. Um, gotta give Josh a little business here. No, I appreciate yeah. that, guys, thank you. Any funny cars, Josh? You run across any of that stuff ever? Sometimes I do. It's just like the market with the guys sometimes. Funny cars. You gonna talk like funny cars, like something like, like these kind of cars? Like yeah, the but the, with the cars. opening top. Those are my fastest Actually, ones. Actually, I do have fun. Do ya? Wow. Wow. Fast this would be in my next King of the Hill. That's cool. Courtesy of Josh. That's awesome. Yeah, I uh, when I first started flea market and watching you guys over and over, uh, there was like no one at this flea market popping up. Like I yeah. might see four people in a week. Wow. And I started like just going down, like opening cars. Like, what is some of that? So I started catching like the P1. Like the P1 wasn't bad, but it seemed like Speed Tail was pretty good. Yeah. Studebaker. You ever raced the Studebaker? Studebaker, probably. I mean, we've. I like to think we've raced just about everything. You know, yeah, I got no discretion of ripping something out of the package and racing it, especially the old metal on metal stuff. I think that stuff from that era was just faster. Yeah. You know, but we have come across some modern castings. Like for a while, the F one fifties were dominating the track, and it's just weird what yeah. what goes fast. You never expect it. You know. Ones that I always like, and I hate when like the little guys ask me, like they'll be like, I'm putting this on my trail. I'm like, okay, but it doesn't weigh that much. Yeah, like, yeah. Some of these cars are, they look cool. Yeah, they look cool, but they won't go around the loop or anything like that. You know? Like these guys right here, no. Body yeah, kit stops on the corner. Yeah. Yeah, you understand. Man, it's sure. so cool talking to you guys. And I spent so yeah, many man. hours. We're at the world famous Hot Wheels Dave, you guys keep asking me about. He's set up here at the show. And so we're going to see what Dave's got. These things, I imagine, are all just different prices, Dave? Yeah. Okay. Good are there, buddy? A good save, wasn't it? Woo! <laughs> <laughs> I was falling as you was. <laughs> My age is never know. I love this thing, so I'm going to have to get that. Look at that one. Man, that is so cool. Dave, where are you is this out of your own personal collection, this no. stuff? Is this no. things you're getting? No, I got another seven months before all my Oh, is that right? Oh. I hear you. No. <laughs> you know what no. you want to do? No. She's gonna dig a hole in the backyard. If I die before her, she's gonna burn it. Don't do that, Sue. Big hole? Don't do that. I was. That's mine and his memories. Well, Sue, you know, 
I was telling Dave, every, every single, no, 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 not that. Every single video though, we get at least one or two comments asking, where is Hot Wheels Dave at? We haven't seen him forever. And so, whether you know it or not, you guys have a tremendous following. Oh, we know. And yeah, and everybody loves you guys. And loves, you know, your prices are fair. You have things that people have never seen before. So, you know, that's a that's an important I mean, part of the, the whole community. Their thoughts and stuff, so. Yeah. Yeah, the four years that we've done before. Well, that's what's yeah, helped that's... you guys, right? That's what gets us all through is the prayers. Yeah. You know, it's been four years now since we've done the food market. I know, man. I, I, mean, I know it's not the same without you guys. You see how you see how hard I got to dig for anything good, Dave. Yep. And then I got to deal with the prices. And I'm like, yeah. I know we got millions of followers. Yeah, man, we do. Some guy come up today. He says, "Hey, I know you. You're in the Hall of Fame. You're this, you're that. I know all that stuff. Oh, believe me, we follow. Yeah. And I. They said we're up in Tennessee. I'll be here about." Where they at? How are they doing? Yep. Well, and that's you guys have preserved, you know, a great collection of cars. It'd be a shame to not at least pass it on to Junior. I mean, oh, Junior's got his collection. Does he? He's got one heck of a collection. Yeah. He bought. He just bought uh, 2010. SRS. SRS? Cadillac, that's awesome. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah. Yeah, a little SUV thing, yeah. A little baby Escalade, yep. Yeah, it's got like 70,000 miles on this thing. It's a pretty freaking truck. Yeah, man. Those are awesome. If you had a little friggin' Altima and the whole new one. Uh, the frame broke on it. Oh my you god. Go down the road and the frame went out. Boom. Oh, jeez. Like, Doctors were out here yesterday and they come back there and shake legs and they said, You brought her so far. They, um, you know, true love is together so that we can That's right. And them doctors said that they see people come in there, their life gets sick and they're on their deathbed, they walk away. Oh, wow. They said, we see it all the time. Yeah. All the time, we see it. I'm just blessed to have you. Man. Let me see what I've got so far. I've been doing some damage. Well, that's great, so. Yeah, that's her in there. Yeah, when we first pulled up, it was pouring out, and she just can't afford to get sick right now. At the market, because you guys aren't out there, I've got a, he's really my only source now, but I, I saw him over here uh, yesterday when we were out here, and um, he had a few things that I was interested in, but, you know, with the rain, I'm, I doubt he's out there anymore. A lot of people, they packed up last night. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. They got them. You know Crash, right, Chris? You got the big one out there in the field? You got big for the display, like 30 days or something. I didn't even see that yesterday. You know there yesterday. This morning, Dave went by there. He said, nope, I'm packing up. I'm not moving it. I'm not selling nothing. We yeah. ran across one guy that owns a car dealership in Tampa. Mm -hmm. Yeah. He has some incredible stuff out there, but it's priced accordingly, yeah. you know? But like I was telling Manny, you know, Manny's more up on what the new stuff is and what it should cost and all that mm -hmm. stuff for resale. And it, it, Manny was telling me, this stuff's price fair, but the way it's in the bins this way, it's scuffing up the packaging. Yeah, so you're exactly. losing value on that yeah. stuff. Well, see, Dave, I'll be honest with you. You're the only one with, with fair prices here at the show. Everybody's jacked their prices up three, four, five bucks. Yeah, you know? and then we get people probably a dollar. I'll give you a quarter piece one. It's like... Walmart, no they're about way. a quarter now. Uh, what? <laughs> you know? Come on. Well, we sold the whole thing. Did you? That's awesome. I know you guys always do well at the show. And everybody gets mad at us. Yes. 
Yeah. Let them be mad, right? That's how everybody knows. Well, this one, I had this one kid who came up. I'll tell you this. I think this was, who was it? Friday or something? Kid come up, bought a car, and took it out there and showed his mom. Uh, he told his mom, so I bought this off a hot well suit, uh, off a hot well baby, too. And um, she said $8, she paid for that. And when him and his mom came here, he got the same car, he made a buck for it. His mom said, where'd you get this? The kid got in trouble, number one, he liked his mom, because yeah. he didn't remember where he got it from. There you and go. He didn't think I was out here, and then I found it. Yeah. Well, there you go. You learned some lessons that way. See these old tea hunts, Manny? Yeah, I have one right here. I'm going to get this one. You're going to get that one? Yummy. Dude, that is... Pink 55? I don't even believe I have that. That's a clean one. And then, you know, I like the blue part. I like this one right here. It's a $20 car. Nope. $20 car right there. <laughs> this is just... Watching all these hot rods this weekend, man. I've got hot rod fever now. You know, when I'm picking stuff, I'm always thinking what's going to be fast, what's heavy. I probably think completely different than the rest of the people that are picking cars. I don't don't pick what I pick unless you're gonna race it. <laughs> oh, <that's sad>. okay. <laughs> well, you collect go cards. That's cool. That's really cool. Let's oh, see, hunts that I'm missing. Got the gases. I got all that stuff already. We're good. I can, I can, I can what you got on that? 20 bucks. 20 bucks? 20 bucks. 20 bucks. Oh, I can't see. <laughs> That's such a neat thing. One less. 75. Man, I should have kept all mine in the package. I had the whole set. Of course, I broke those out and raced them. All right, guys. One last look at how goes Dave's booth. We got some loose cars, too, but I really don't. If I want to get any loose ones right now. Great stuff though. Take a look at it. Some great stuff. Man. Great, great stuff. I love that car right there too. Yeah, oh, that's clean. Can I get that one? Is that the cleanest one? I think it is. This is neat too, man. 15 bucks metal on metal. Freaking bolt is now five to nine dollars. Oh yeah, you know what I mean. Yeah, yeah. I said, Lord have mercy. So I went and got threaded rod. And Great to see Hot Wheels, Dave and Sue. Picked up a couple cool things. Need to meet that guy, Josh. Not a great time to come to a car show in the rain, but it is what it is. Let's go home and see what we got. Back home. Well, we had to go just about everywhere, but awesome haul this week. I always start off with some carded stuff. Got all these cars for 15 bucks. Not bad. 
here. Let's see what we got. Got the Hyper Mite. Cute little guy. Nice gold motor. Notoriously fast car right here. The Honda Spocket. Another fast one. That is Speed Shark. Normally I'd pass this casting up in a heartbeat, but 15 bucks for all of it. Not bad. This is Roll Patrol. Nice fantasy cop car. Flame job. I wonder if that's an actual car. Looks like a Ford Mondeo, maybe. I don't know. Kind of got an R32 looking front end. Look at this. Diora. Not the Diora 2. Diora. Surfboards come out. Cowabunga on the side. Man, it's beautiful out, guys. 55 degrees out. A little bit of a breeze, kind of overcast. Hopefully these cars are showing up well in this light. It's the Hyperliner. That whole top comes off of that thing to show the roll cage and the interior. What's this? Ah, that is... Fat back exhausted. Kind of looks like the twin mill, but obviously not. The fat back tires popping a wheelie. Here we have Lotus M250. Nice silver car with a red interior. Beauty. A lot of metal here. Sweet 16. This is cool. I don't believe I have this. Vulture Roadster. I have a car called the Vulture or Vulture. This one's different. It's a wild casting. There's a mail truck. Hot Wheels Post Office. Faster than ever. Mail delivery. Be cool if it had actual fashion number wheels. But Dodge Sidewinder. Ramp truck. Backslider. This little thing. Pedal driver. Here we have the Phaeton. Snake on the side with the fangs. What? Another one of these things. Here we have semi fast. Nice translucent body. That's another, oh, that's Open Roadster. Another casting I don't really remember having, but I might. Don't tell me I got three of these. Come on, you got to be kidding me. Two was too many. Three? Wow. Yeah, I could take one apart and do something with that engine. Anybody like this casting? Here we have a, what a drag, exactly. Three-wheeler. Kind of neat with the Hot Wheels logo on the tail. And, well, guy got me. Yeah, that's all right, I'm not complaining. 15 bucks for all this. Guy might have got the better end of that deal. I did find some loose stuff that's pretty cool. Von Dutch car. Well, I call it the Von Dutch. I don't know if it's officially the Von Dutch or not. What's it say? Tribute Customs. The skull up there. The eyeball. And 
Hey, I got this, I believe. Beautiful ultra hot chrome bends. Man, that's nice. Great roller, too. Awesome. Then, right as I was walking out, found four cars. Look at this. Made in England. It's a Holden pickup. 1977 Lesney. Not sure if something was supposed to be in the back of this or if it just looked like that. Of course, got the tow hitch. Still rolls great. Man, that is neat. And what is this one? Maserati Bora. Bora. Made in England. Opening doors. Oh, man, gross. Something died in there. Maybe a little rust. Interesting. Have to clean that out, but casting is from '72, so not sure if this one's from '72. Looks like it might be a little newer with this paint scheme, but and we got a matchbox. This is a made in China matchbox, but rare to find one with the actual guy in the bucket. <laughs> Very neat. Always like these old fire trucks. There we go. And oh, I see what this is. This is like metal fell out of that thing. Like a piece of actual iron. I was gonna say diecast doesn't rust, so whatever that was was actual metal. There's a chunk of it. This thing. Police pickup. I like the way it sits. It's kind of low. No lift kit, but got the wide out wheels. Kind of in style now. Well, we did all right at the market, but not enough stuff. So we ended up at the pegs at Walmart. Start off with some Matchbox Muscle, the C8 Corvette. Love that one. So look at the cars that come in the set. Matchbox Muscle, 2019 Ford Mustang. And we got a Charger. How's your guys' stores looking at this time of year? I always love the fact they keep it so nice and stocked, especially right before Black Friday, and, and nobody tends to go over there. You know, everybody's paying attention to the specials. Everybody forgets to go down the actual Hot Wheels aisle, and then I come in and scoop it all up. Here's the 69 Camaro. Yeah, I'll scoop it all up. But I get my fair share. 70 Plymouth Cuda. Love this muscle series. Great job from Matchbox. Speaking of muscle, the 80 El Camino. Not too fond of the paint chipping on the bottom already. That doesn't look too good. That should have never passed quality control right there, but it did. McLaren Solus GT. Wow, that thing looks crazy. I don't know, man. Some of this paint is looking a little janky. I'm going to have to put these things under a microscope and kind of magnify them a bit so we can see just how good or not good Hot Wheels is doing with the quality. Power panel. Not bad. This thing. Very cool color. Flat red. Solero GT, written down the top of it. There's this, the Mad Manga. It's a police version. I never noticed the intercooler sitting right there on the wing. The wing, it's not a wing, that's a lip. Just a big lip. 
And we've got this very cool Mitsubishi Pajero Evolution. Love the wheels on that. These things in real life are crazy. And we got this thing. Speaking of crazy, the Mad Mike Drift Attack. Wild looking car. Think you can go see that in action. More stuff from Walmart to pick up another Nissan five pack. Love this. Dotson 620, Fair Lady S13, R32, 2000 GTX. A lot of good ones in there. This thing's neat. 57 Jeep FC. Yeah. Maybe a couple bad ones slip by Hot Wheels, but for the most part, they do a great job with their, their Campos. Look at this. Classic Nomad. Love this car. Hey. Okay, now, I thought I saw a variation, but I didn't. Beauty. Another Mad Mike drift car. Koenigsegg Gemera, or Gamera. Interesting car. Can't say it's my favorite Koenigsegg, but still neat. This thing. Trans Am. Stripe on the hood, kind of offset, pretty neat. Great color scheme. This thing, man. When I saw this, I was like, what? This is crazy. Land Rover with a surfboard, fold down window, spare tire on the hood. <laughs> wow, this is cool. That might be top three castings of the year, just for the obscurity. Another Nomad. Beauty right here. 69 Dodge Charger. Gold wheels. Gold Dodge symbol. Wow. Love that. Another cool one here. Limited grip. The fuel tank in the back. LS1 in the front. That's really neat. Another one that's probably in the top three castings of the year, the Alfa Romeo GT V6 3.0. Perfect wheels. I mean, X's on the headlights. Man, just, just a great job. Beautiful. Still going from Walmart. I'm telling you guys, I racked up. Had to pick up the Jaws 75 Chevy Blazer Custom. was in that series but that's the one I wanted and we got some shorties and I believe if I'm not mistaken yeah these were 70 cents each for Black Friday they had a whole dump bin of short cards and then they made their way over to the pegs so matchbox 70 cents great when you can pick up matchbox for 70 cents Audi TT RS Coupe. And we got a 34 Chevy Master Coupe. Love that one. Another beauty. 53 Buick Skylark Convertible. Shorty card. Check out the little spotlights they do in the background. That's neat. <laughs> Look at that. Cool. Guess they put that on all these. 75 Opal Cadet. Tail lights. Cadet C on the license plate. Front grill and headlights. Great job. Man. Here we have a Gladiator. We rented one of these one time and 
we were going to take the doors off and the top. And then I looked at a tutorial and I was like, wow, it's going to take about an hour. And we're bound to lose a screw and then return it with no door. Yeah. We decided not to. But still cool. This thing. Mazda RX-8. These cars are slept on in real life. I know they got problems, but still pretty cool. This BMW Touring. So wagon. Interesting choice to put that glare on the taillight. And the headlights are done well. Another shorty here. 57 Ford Custom 300. I think I picked up two of these, right? Oh, yeah. Had to get two. Might do a gas route on one of these. Love that casting. Make sure we're far enough over here. Still going with the matchbox. That's the Porsche 911 Rally. Awesome casting, man. Awesome car. Another beauty. Look at that. 41 Plymouth Coupe. What a color. Let's see if I can slide these over a bit. What a Goodyear tire service vehicle. The Renault Kangoo. This 65 Ford C900. Awesome looking little truck. Land Rover Defender. Cool with a clear top. See the whole interior. Here we have a Holden. Commodore SSV Highway Patrol. Same car as a Chevy SS, but the Australian version. Another RX-8. I heard this is the taxi that they use in New York, the Mustang Mach-E. Interesting. And you have a Porsche 911 Carrera Cabriolet. The notorious Boxster front end. 9-11 guys were up in arms when that front end came out, but I personally like it. I think this particular model year is kind of slept on. And we have a F-150 Lightning electric vehicle. This thing. <laughs> Volvo 240. Not very fond of the wheel selection on this one. I think Matchbox has a few other wheels that would have worked better. But still pretty cool. Nice and boxy. Got another Jeep. This thing. Pretty neat. Trouble Decker. Kind of heavy. You know, it's plastic. It's quite a bit of it. We got this. Track Pursuit. Little cop car. Dodge Charger. Tesla Roadster. Nice orange. Bright car. And Layin' Lowrider. Pretty neat. Last bit of stuff from Walmart. Dodge Hemi Challenger. High Wheels Boulevard car. Beautiful in black. Black wheels. It's on the back. I wish I'd have found that yellow 911, but oh well. Happy with that one. Did get this Mercedes Benz 190E 2.516. That's nice. Looks great. Let's compare it while we got it out to the. Where is it? There it is. 
Majorette version. Of course, this is the Evolution 2, but really the same car when you look at it. Which one you guys like better, the Hot Wheels version or the Majorette? Majorette looks a little stumpy. Still great detail. If you blacked out the middle between the spokes, those wheels would look better, but you could always do that with a little Sharpie. I think I like this one better. Of course, I'm partial to Hot Wheels. Majorette does a great job on some casting, so Ford Mustang GT opening doors. Great interior. Nice detail on the car. Of course, they come with a little box, too, to put them in. It's always neat. Dodge Demon. Put that on the drag pack setup, and it'll look really nice. It's kind of on its street tires right now. Looks great, though. This thing, Aston Martin. Vantage GTB. Cool-looking headlights, grill. That's pretty awesome, actually. It's great to see these Majorettes showing up over here. Toyota 2000 GT. Nice looking car. Looks like they just shared the same Porsche wheels. Those look like Fuchs. But here's the exact wheels I'm talking about. Porsche 911 Carrera RS 2.7 with the little collector tin. That's awesome. What a car, man. I love that the opening feature actually shows the engine. That's cool. I'd rather have a opening hood showing an engine than opening doors. Really, it'd be great to have all of it, right? Oh, one last scraggler in here, another 240. Hey, now I can do a wheel swap. All right, guys, great time to take a break. When we come back, we'll look at all the stuff I got out at the Turkey Rod Run, including the stuff from Hot Wheels Dave's booth. Be right back. We're back. Great time at the Turkey Rod Run. I've been going out there for almost 30 years. So, not quite as long as it's been going on. This was the 50th anniversary Turkey Rod Run. So we got a collector cup. This one is the this is great rip the box, Chris. This is the uh, aluminum. That's nice. Daytona Beach Street rods on the side. Check that out. A little history for you guys to read. where it was held at over the years and then finally in 1990 which I started going maybe a little bit after that it ended up in Daytona Speedway anyway man, if you can get down here for this and you're a car person you won't be sorry man it's awesome some other memorabilia in your little bag pretty neat it's a whole event, too, so I think it starts on Thanksgiving. Friday night, they have a cruise in with a bunch of cars. Please do not touch. A lot of cool stuff you get. They do some neat photos of the cars. When you show up, here's a whole map. They also give you a bunch of tickets and door prize stuff. So you can share these with anybody you want to bring along. And, of course, I always got to get an event t-shirt, so... There's a t-shirt this year. Very neat. I usually bring the vet out, but the vet's having a little problem with the clutch right now, so I had to bring out the AMG this time. If you want to see the cars that were out at the show, be sure to go over to Ghost Trucker Garage. I'm going to put up a short video of some of the cars we saw this year. From the swap meet out there, we got some cool stuff. Ran into this guy. Huh. He owns this in Hudson, Florida. Museum of Vanning. So the guy had all kinds of die-cast vans. It was really neat. 
ripped card, but a little rider van, Ford Transit. Pretty awesome. I think I got these for a buck. Look at that. Chevy van, one of my favorite, the 4x4 four four. claws on the side. Love these big matchbox wheels. This one, the aluminum minivan, taxi. I believe I got that for a buck. Black walls. Very neat. This thing. 86 Toyota van. Perfect color scheme, too. Baja breaker. Always love that casting with the Goodyear on the side. Look at this. Turbo tread. Maisto van. Looks to be a Toyota van. A little palm tree. Photo finish Aerostar. Look at that. A little picture of the capital on the side. That's awesome. And last from the van guy. Couldn't believe he gave me this for a buck. Got real riders on it. It's probably a little worse for wear. That rubber looks like it's coming off the rim somehow, but neat van. The Greenbrier Sports Wagon. Heavy casting. Oh, I got this from Josh. Shout out to Fast and Furious Josh. He had that cool super out there. Man, that thing was neat. Very nice to meet you, Josh. And we got the 911 GT3. Gave me a free blister pack, too. So we can keep it nice. I think that was the Kroger exclusive. And look at this. Josh hooked me up with two free funny cars. That was awesome of him. Got a side splitter. Well, both of them are side splitters, right? Same car. Nice heavy castings. Put those in our next King of the Hill. Thanks again, Josh. Finally caught up with Hot Wheels Dave out there. Dave was kind enough to let us film what we got. Hot Wheels Dave, look what I got here. Johnny Lightning, American Flashbacks in Time. That is just cool. Scenic Overlook with the little people. Awesome looking 55, jacked up there. Cops rolling up on the scene. Wonder why he's looking in the back window. And we got a Drag Racing Platinum Series. Mr. B's Passionate Poncho, 421 cubic inch. I don't believe I've ever even seen these cars. Oh, it's open. I didn't open it. That's right, now we get to get it out and look at it. Barney Beswick. That's cool, comes in that little protective plastic inside of the bubble, nice. The Matchbox Super Fast, Dodge Viper. Nice one there. Corvette C6R. Love that car. Skull Rider. Not sure exactly why I picked this one up. Must have been talking too much. Not paying attention. I know why I got this one. Biggest, faster than ever wheels ever created on this Hummer H3. I love those. Very cool. I got another one of these. Sweet 16. Worth its weight in die cast. And drop the base. Base. And we got the boom box. Looking tough with the gold interior. Speakers all in the back. Yeah, great cast. Okay, enough. And TV series Batmobile. Always love that one. This one has the fashion ever wheels on. Which means the Joker's definitely not getting away. This thing. Gold Unobtainium. 
That is crazy. Beautiful. Very fast casting. Let's see, Cadillac V16. Take a look at the actual concept car of this. Wild looking. Another ramp truck, back slider. It's a neat one. And this one with the skinny wheels. Pretty quick. The tiny little narrow wheels on it. Got myself a GoPro car. Always love to pick these up when I see them. One of those two packs. One guy had a bunch of them out there, but all the cards were a little beat up. Ended up waiting and finding one from Dave. Paid $3 more from Dave, too, but it's in good shape. And look at this. Chevrolater. Love those wheels. It's just a nice one. Designer's challenge. Oh, that's right. That's when they had these guys design their own Hot Wheels, and this guy won. I believe he did. Look at this one. Man, love that thing right there. 58 Corvette jacked up in the back. You need to see that you can look at it from both sides without taking it out. And then last, we got these four matchbox. All of them cool. Rally vet with the rubber tires. Not sure what's on the back. The Wales Project. Series one. Look at that one. Man, I love that thing. That is awesome. Another vet, C3. All these rubber tires. And last one, perhaps the best one. Very cool. Well, guys, there you have it. Pretty massive haul of cars. Man, a lot of fun getting them, too. All right, guys. Happy picking out there. Great time to be doing it. Hope you find what you're looking for. Take care. I'm going to have to take a little day trip. Go check this place out. Check out the vans, man. Wow. Awesome. Way, way back, I did a video over on Ghost Jerker called When You Leave a Car Show, Do This. And it features a lot of the old timers from Bel Air Plaza. Bel Air Plaza is no more. They're doing remodeling and they got it all busted up. So anyway, neat piece of history.